The ocean is one of the least explored places on Earth, full of mysteries and wonders. In this watery world, no creature is as powerful or as enigmatic as the orca, often known as the killer whale. But why are they called killers? Does this name truly reflect their nature? Join us as we explore the complex world of orcas, from the origins of the name killer whale to how they live and hunt. You may be surprised by what we can learn from these majestic creatures. Where did the name killer whale come from? To understand, we must go back to the 18th century, when the first Spanish explorers ventured into the Arctic and Antarctic waters. They saw orcas hunting and killing other marine creatures, from sharks to larger whales. Thus, they named them Balena Asesina, meaning killer whale. But does this name truly reflect their nature? When fishermen and explorers first observed the orca's impressive hunting abilities, they were struck by how these whales coordinated to take down larger prey. This led them to give the orca a name that conjured the image of cold-blooded killers of the sea. However, today, we know this was a misunderstanding. Orcas are apex predators of the ocean with no natural threats. What sets them apart is their sophisticated hunting techniques. Unlike many predators, orcas don't rely solely on brute strength. They use intelligence and group coordination to outwit prey, ranging from small fish to larger marine animals. What's fascinating about orcas is that their hunting strategies vary depending on their prey and habitat. Orcas in Antarctica have developed tactics to dislodge seals from ice, while those in the North Pacific often use encircling strategies to trap schools of fish. These techniques demonstrate their intelligence and adaptability to different environments. Orcas are not just remarkable hunters, but also have complex social structures and communication systems. They live in close-knit family pods that sometimes span multiple generations. Each pod has its own unique set of sounds, much like a human language. Each orca pod has a distinct sound profile, which they use for communication, navigation, and hunting. This is much like a human fingerprint. No two pods share the same sound patterns. Orcas also engage in playful and intricate social interactions, such as playing with waves or objects. One of the most remarkable aspects of orcas is their intelligence. These creatures exhibit complex problem-solving abilities, creativity in hunting, and even cultural transmission of knowledge from one generation to the next. Orcas have been observed using simple tools like creating waves to knock prey off ice. They are also known to plan sophisticated hunting strategies and even share knowledge within their pods. I'm going to start with official grailers who have the longest relationship and hunting relationship. The relationship between orcas and humans has evolved over time. Once hunted, orcas are now seen as symbols of nature's power. However, these intelligent and social creatures suffer greatly in captivity. <laughs> captivity presents a major ethical dilemma. Orcas in captivity often exhibit abnormal behaviors due to the lack of space and natural environments. Conservation organizations and the scientific community are working tirelessly to protect orcas and prevent harmful activities, from captivity to habitat degradation. Orcas are not only intelligent and social creatures, but also play a crucial role in the marine ecosystem. We are 
are seeing the impacts of climate change and pollution on orchids. Some orca populations have dwindled significantly due to food shortages and polluted habitats. This is a time when scientists and conservationists must collaborate closely to protect the marine environment. The future of orcas is in our hands. We must protect not only the orcas, but also the vast marine environment in which they live. By understanding and respecting their role in the ecosystem, we can ensure that these powerful creatures thrive in the years to come. It's crucial to shift our approach to marine conservation. Protecting orcas also means preserving the entire marine ecosystem on which they depend. We are at a pivotal moment, and our success will determine the future of these incredible marine animals. The story of orcas is one of strength, intelligence, and balance in nature. While the name killer whale may invoke fear, these are intelligent and social beings that play a crucial role in the marine ecosystem. These creatures deserve our respect and protection. Let us learn from nature and do everything we can to ensure that future generations have the opportunity to witness and admire these magnificent beings. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the world of orcas. May we continue to learn from and protect these incredible creatures for generations to come. What do you think about orcas and the issue of marine environment protection? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. And finally, don't forget to subscribe to the Love Animal channel to stay with us.